Hey everyone, Techno Mentor here with a video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix call failed on your iPhone 15 Pro Max or any other iPhone after the latest iOS 26 update. You want to follow these steps to fix it. First thing is pull down that control menu and put your phone on airplane mode briefly like that and then turn it off and go ahead and try see if that works. Now if that didn't work for you, the next thing you want to go ahead and try to do is for a carrier update. So in your setting, you're going to go to general about and then wait on this page for about 10 15 seconds to see if you get a message that says update carrier if there is an update it'll pop up if there is an update we can move on to the next thing the next thing it's going to be if your phone has a physical sim card with it we need to switch it out so if you have a physical sim card some models that are out of the US region will have a physical SIM card. It's going to be on your left side here. So this phone, for example, on your left side, you're going to take a SIM ejector tool and then, or a paper clip, bend over, take that physical SIM card if you have it, and then basically you're going to swap it to the back side if you have a dual SIM one. So switching the SIM slot, which I'll show you what that looks like. So here in the picture, I don't have a phone, but basically if you the SIM is on the top, you're going to bring it to the bottom. If it's on the bottom, bring it to the top. If you have that dual SIM slot on your iPhone. That will go ahead and fix it. Now, if you happen to have an eSIM card on your phone, what you need to do is go into your setting, go to cellular, and then you're gonna turn on and off the eSIM here on your phone. That will basically resync the SIM. Now, if you're still having an issue, the next thing you wanna do is in your setting, you're gonna look for, search in the search bar here, lockdown. You're gonna search for lockdown mode. In the lockdown mode, if this is turned on, you need to turn off the lockdown mode. For some reason, it gets turned on. You might not have done it, but after the update, some devices are seeing this. So make sure this lockdown mode is turned off, which you shouldn't need. So go ahead and turn that off and go ahead and try again. Now, if you're still in the issue, the next thing you're going to do is this method here. You're going to quickly press and release volume up, volume down, and then hold on to the side button until the screen goes completely black and the Apple logo appears. So I'll do volume up, volume down, and then I hold on to the side button just like this. And just keep on holding here until the screen goes completely black. So we're gonna wait here, and then once you see the Apple logo appear, we will let go of that side button. Now if it doesn't work the very first time, go ahead and try again. It takes sometimes a couple tries to get the hang of this. Basically all we're doing is quickly pressing and releasing volume up, volume down, before holding down that side button known as a force restart which basically forces the phone software to shut down completely and then reload the code so if there's an issue with the software it'll go ahead and fix it now the next thing you want to do is go into your setting go to general and then go all the way down here transfer or reset iphone and you click on that here and we're going to click on reset we're going to do a network setting reset which will delete all the network settings back to factory default. It will not delete your data like photos, videos, apps. Everything will still be on your phone, but something you need to do if you're still having issues. Now, if you're still having the call failed issue on your phone, the final thing to do is go ahead and contact your phone carrier company. See if they have an update they can push out depending on your carrier. Sometimes they need to do something on their end with the latest version that was updated to make sure your phone is running as well. So those are going to be the fixes. I hope this video was helpful. So please consider a like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks. We'll see you guys next time.